Right ventricular hypertrophy is a form of ventricular hypertrophy affecting the right ventricle. Blood travels through the right ventricle to the lungs via the pulmonary arteries. If conditions occur which decrease pulmonary circulation, meaning blood does not flow well from the heart to the lungs, extra stress can be placed on the right ventricle. This can lead to right ventricular hypertrophy. It can affect ECG findings. An ECG with right ventricular hypertrophy may or may not show a right axis deviation on the graph. Causes, common causes include, pulmonary hypertension, tetralogy of fallot, pulmonary valve stenosis, pulmonic regurgitation, ventricular septal defect, high altitude, cardiac fibrosis, chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, athletic heart syndrome. ECG findings General ECG features include, right axis deviation, taller waves in RV leads, deep S waves in LV leads, slight increase in QRS duration, street T changes directed opposite to QRS direction, may see incomplete RBBB pattern or QR pattern in V1, evidence of right atrial enlargement, specific ECG features, any one or more of the following in presence of disease capable of causing RVH are in AVR greater than 5 mm, or, are in AVR Q and AVR, any one of the following in lead V1, RS ratio greater than 1 and negative T wave, Q or pattern, are greater than 6 mm, or S 10 mm. Other chest lead criteria, are in V1 plus S in V5 10 mm, RS ratio in V5 or V6 7 mm, Street segment depression and T wave inversion in right precordial leads is usually seen in severe RVH, such as in pulmonary stenosis and pulmonary hypertension. References Lesson 8 Ventricular Hypertrophy. Retrieved January 7, 2009. Sect 4, CH7, Acclimatization to High Altitude. External links 02004 at Chorus, HTTP. Library Med Utah EDU ECG Lesson 8 Slash Index HTML RVH